Hello everyone, hope you're doing good. If you want to check if your RAM is working properly on your laptop or a desktop, if you have two RAMs, three RAMs or a single RAM and you have any doubt that your RAM is not performing well and you have some issues with your RAM, you can check and fix it by yourself. So it will work on Windows 11 and Windows 10 both. So I'll let you know how you can check your RAM performance and if you have any errors in your RAM, you can check it by yourself. So here in the search icon, whether it's a Windows 11, 7, 8 or 10, in the search icon, we need to type Windows Memory and you will find Windows Memory Diagnostic. Now here you will get open or run as administrator. So my recommendation would be to select run as administrator because it will be more effective. So I have selected run as administrator and very soon we will get a new window. Now here it says check your computer for memory problems. So if you have any memory problem, um, it can cause a computer lose information or it may stop working. So to fix that, we can run this Windows Memory Diagnostic. Now here we are getting two options. Restart now and check for problems recommended. Save your work and close any open programs before restarting. And the second option is check for problems that next time I start my computer. So since the top one is recommended, so to fix memory problems, we will go to the recommended one and we will click on restart now and check for problems and if you have any others window open you can save it and close it so i'll click on restart now and very soon we will get an option to restart it will automatically restart the computer and we will get a new window soon now i can see windows is checking for memory problems this might take several minutes, running test pass, one of two, zero percent complete. Overall test status is showing here and you, you will also let you know, I mean, you will be able to know whether you have any problems detected or not. So currently till now, it says no problem have been detected yet. So we don't have to make any changes. We just need to wait here and it might take two to 15 minutes. It depends on your computer and once this is done it will fix your memory problems so i can see it as one percent complete since it's a virtual computer it might take some time but in your actual computer it will not take much time to do so so i can see it's getting faster and we can check the status as well so once this is done, you just need to restart your computer and you can let me know what is the results displayed in your computer. So I hope you have enjoyed this very short tutorial. And guys, if this tutorial is helpful, please hit the like and subscribe and leave a comment. I'll see you in the next video. Have a wonderful day.